Saved interview 39. Patient's name is Edward Nigma. At this point in time, I have yet to decide if Mr. Nigma is a suitable candidate for the Titan process. I'd like to talk about your childhood. Miserable. Next. By all accounts, that is where your fascination with riddles began. I believe discussing those years could explain your compulsive behavior. Very well. My father hated me. Always called me a moron. I was determined to prove him wrong, so I entered a contest at school. A $20 prize to the kid who could figure out an almost impossible logic problem. I won, of course. And that pleased your father? Hardly. He was convinced I had cheated. He kept yelling, you must have cheated! Admit it, you moron, you cheated! I swore I didn't, and he hit me for lying. I'm sorry to hear that, Edward. Don't be. He was right.
please remain calm and move slowly to their accommodation. Let me introduce you all to the sterling work of our new head of research, Dr. Penelope Young. Batman! Don't speak. You're safe now. But, but it's a trap! I know. Just not for me. <gasps> it's true! You really are the world's greatest detective! How did you do that, Bats? Oh, what the hell? Get down there, boys! See if he can detect being punched in the face! Don't get too full of yourself, Bats. I'm just softening you up. Think of this as a preview to the main event. You'll see. Please, get me out of this thing. I'm sorry. I tried to tell you. I couldn't speak. Relax, you're safe now. I can handle these low-life thugs. 